afternoon, everyone. Alrighty, alrighty. On our way to uh, Delaware Paddle Sports to pick up the new yak, the new Hobie. Uh, I think we're about uh, 30 minutes out, so we will be back. Um, and we're going to pick it up, do a quick um, walkthrough of everything that we uh, got put on. And then bring it home and hopefully I'll be able to get it in order next weekend. Uh, it's going to be raining tomorrow, overcast today, so really not going to get to put it in order today. But we definitely want to um, get it in order. Hopefully next week Saturday. Can't do it Sunday, Mother's Day. Uh, uh -huh. So you guys out there, remember <laughs> your mothers and your wives and your mother-in-laws and your sister-in-laws and every, everybody else. Uh, see you soon. At Delaware Paddle Sports, picking up the new boat. You excited? I am. Uh, yeah, yeah, pretty cool. Right. Nice anything new is cool, but yeah, it's a good start. Some of this we left because of the rain, so I got the plastic on your seat. Yeah. Keep it nice and dry. There we go. All right. Uh, we're here at Delaware Paddle Sports picking up the new yak. Uh, Chris is not here, but Dean, Dean is here right, to uh, set us up with the new Hobie Pro Angler 14 and the Malone Mega Sport Trailer. We're just going to do a quick walkthrough today and then we'll do a more detailed one when we uh, actually put it on the water. Not next weekend, I guess, because it's Mother's Day weekend, um, the weekend after. We could give them a little shot of some lights real quick if you want to show them some lights. Yeah, we could do that. Let's do that. Let's see this. Hold the battery real quick, Dean. I'm in the front. I think we kept it hooked up for him. Did you disconnect know. it? So we really, we really just, we didn't, myself. we didn't overdo it. Um, just really put some basic stuff on there to get going. Uh, so we did a um, yacht power, power system uh, with some lighting in the front and the back. We got some pen lights inside. Yes, this one. We got the yak, the yak power control module. Nope. I got it. Okay, I, I see lights. So we can go over this real quick, Patrick. You can. I'm gonna do. Let me so I can see what I'm hitting here. So real quickly, we got the yak power system in. I'm gonna turn everything off. So at a quick touch, Patrick's now gonna be able to power his system up. Hit one bow light system and his bow lights will turn on and that's with a b then if he hits the m which is his midship you'll notice his interior lights pop on oh, yes. okay. 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 and then of course he has his stern lights all in a quick of a switch Back. and if we don't have it now at the present but he also has a Lowrance that is also in a power mood that he can hit just yeah, one uh, and then his uh, Lowrance will power. Like, and then he uh, has a cool system that not many of us have done in this, but he has three uh, power port, ports that he can use. So he has uh, that on control, all three on a on switch two. So, so we have a USB inside the uh, bucket there and that's for phones. Uh, we have another power port up front, and I just did it out of the um, existing harness, so we can just put anything on it. And then for future proofing, um, like with a power pole or anything in the back, we've got a power port here that we can just drop something in. So that, that should pull us over for right now. And I can pop all these lights off. We'll kill this. And then, of course, he has one in here as well. I don't know if you saw that one, but he has a source here as well. And this is this is the one of the newest things that uh, Yak Power came out with this year. So it's basically still a power port. You plug their USB adapter in there, so you can use it as a power port. You can uh, plug your USB accessories in there and good to go. Very good feature. So that's one little feature. Of course, his Lowrance is in here. Uh, see, we left, the, you know, covered. He pr probably could go over the feet. He's going to go over, I'm sure, this in detail. And then, of course, he's got the Mega, uh, mega Sport trailer. Anchor trolley on his uh, left side. Spare tire, spare tire on the Mega Sport. 
I'm so sure he's going to give you a full detail. Went to the Mega Sport because I'm going to be hauling about three kayaks. So me and my sons. So that's why we upgraded to the Mega Sport. We got the uh, pull-out storage, which is going to be convenient. Um, I would have gotten a rack, but you really can't get to the rack storage with the kayak with the trailer fully loaded. So that's why I went with the pull-out that's on wheels. Um, and it has the beefed-up tire, so should be good to go. All right. So we'll be checking in with you guys in a couple of weeks. All um, right. Once we go through a full walkthrough right, and put it on the work. See you Thank later. You. Hey, I just wanted to take a moment to throw a big shout out and thanks to Delaware Paddle Sports and all of the guys and the crew down there from Chris to Dean to Mike um, and just that whole team down there who helped me get um, into my new Hobie. Uh, last fall, I started on my journey to kind of start researching and looking at getting into a pedal drive kayak and, and I visit the store down in Lewes, Delaware off a of coastal highway. And those guys down there was just incredible from the knowledge base and providing, you know, different information, not really trying to sell you hard on anything, but trying to find the right product that, that fits your needs to later on in the spring where I ordered my kayak and then work with them to set it up and get delivery on it. Um, and just the overall support and customer service and experience and knowledge that all those guys had. So it was nothing but a great, great experience um, from them. I also picked up my uh, Malone Megasport trailer um, from them as well. So again, I really, really wanted to thank uh, Delaware Sports and the whole team. And I recommend anybody um, that's in the Delaware Valley or close by to lose Delaware, really do yourself a favor um, and go check those guys out or give them a call. Um, they're extremely helpful. Um, experienced kayak anglers um, as well as a stand-up paddleboard um, guys um, and just great great support if i can't say anything else um, just the customer service and the overall support um, that you get from those guys that are outstanding so thank you guys again um, i got a great kayak from them rigged out well and uh, enjoyed my first season with it